was My Creole Bell, composed by J.B. Lampy around 1900 and made famous by Mississippi John Hurt in the early 60s. I tapped out the two uh, verses I played and you'll find the link in the video description that will lead you to my website where you can download the tap for free. Uh, you will see the icon of a PDF for that just above the screen of this video on that website. We're in standard tuning. And here are my E's. And we're playing this out of the key of C, using C chords, F chords, and G chords. All right, let's play the first uh, couple bars. It has an alternating bass. And we start with the first bar. So that's the first line of the tap, the first four bars. So we have that C chord, pinch, add the pinky to the third fret second string. And in the middle of that last beat of that first measure, you go to a F chord. And it's best to fret this with the temp wrap because later on we're going to have to play open strings and with a bar, open strings like this, well, it's not, let's say, inconvenient. And it's a good way to learn this because it's very practical uh, for other chords as well. So, F, simply alternating bass between the sixth and fourth string. Third bar, open string, pinch, third fret, second string, open string, and in the last beat we're going back to our C chord to play that open G string. Bar five. C chord, C7, add the pinky to the third fret, third string. Open string, first string, and open G string. So that fifth bar. Going to the G chord. So let's play that this, those first six bars one more time. And then we have the first ending, G chord. G7. And then we start again. Let those melody notes ring. Second ending, bar 9 and 10. And going to our C again. 
So, in the variation we're adding a few things, making it more, let's say, fancy. And I'll play it slowly first. So in bar 11 we have a C chord and add the pinky to the 1st string, 3rd fret. And there you see that the alternating bass moves. So you're going to have to move your 3rd finger to the 6th string, 3rd fret. Pinky, 3rd fret, 2nd string. Go to our F chord. So the 12th bar, two melody notes, and then we have two hammer ons. And you see they are spread over two beats each. G chord, pinky, just slide it up and the temp wrap on the 6th string 3rd fret. Go back and a C chord. Alright, let's play that again, starting from bar 15. And you can do you either go down, slide. I think that's the easiest uh, thing to do because then you're already the other fingers are already ready for the C chord in bar 18. And then we start at bar 11 again. So the second ending is the G chord, G7, hammer on, first fret, first string, pinky on the third fret, second string. So that's it for my Creole Bell. Check out the internet uh, on YouTube, there are more lessons on this song and maybe probably uh, some other variations and you can link this also with other Mississippi John Hurt tunes like uh
So you see there's a lot of possibilities here to make an interesting medley of uh, Mississippi John Hurt tunes and other stuff probably. Okay, have fun! <laughs>